I'm Molly and I'm seven going on eight. How the heck is melanin produced? Why do, why do we have freckles? So I'm Lisa Arkin. I am a pediatric dermatologist at UW and I take care of lots of kids with freckles, which I think is why they've asked me to answer this question. Freckles are composed of an ingredient called melanin and melanin protects against UV damage. So in essence, your body makes melanin to protect against the damage from the sun. So in people who have darker skin, when they make melanin, it looks like a suntan. In people who have very light skin, it often comes out as these kind of finely clumped granules of melanin and they look like freckles. So you're more likely to have them if you have light hair or red hair and light eyes, in part because you're therefore less likely to be able to actually create a tan. So there is kind of a familial predisposition to having it and there's some genetic basis for that as well, meaning it, it's kind of part of your DNA. Um, but over time, it's also a sign of having had sun exposure because again, your body is making melanin to try to protect itself from damage from ultraviolet light. Um, but melanin is actually produced along a pathway that converts tyrosine, which is an amino acid, so one of the protein building blocks of life. And it converts it through a series of enzymes. Enzymes are a bit like the key that unlocks the door. Um, that convert it into one of two types of melanin. The purpose is always the same, to protect your body from the sun. The adage says that 80% of the sun exposure that people attain over their lifetime actually happens in the first 18 years. So childhood is probably the biggest risk for sun exposure. But that's why we talk to parents about the fact that, um, you know, the the prevention measures they use now are really important, not just for now, but for a child's whole lifetime.